Hi there, this is Allison with Let's Go Travel Tips. Welcome to our channel today. Today we're going to talk about wearing a mask on a cruise ship and I've got some new information about that that I think you might want to think about and so we're going to talk about this today. So welcome, I am so grateful to all of our Let's Go family members who have come back and joined us today and also welcome to all of you who are brand new. We are really glad that you found us and happy to have you here today. And so first of all, um, I wanted to talk about this because we get a lot of comments, not only in our comments underneath our videos, but we get a lot of direct messages and um, also um, several emails we have received about masking and having to wear a mask on a cruise ship and whether we should have to or not and really what's going on with that. And so first of all, I just want to let you know that um, what the main cruise lines are doing with that. As I've mentioned before, with Princess Royal Caribbean and Carnival, they all make you wear a mask indoors. Well, I say make, they ask you to please wear a mask when you are in the indoor areas on the ship unless you're eating or drinking, okay? And Princess has said that at least through February 28th of 2022, they expect that to be their requirement. And Royal Caribbean and Carnival have announced that they expect through March 31st of 2022 that that is going to need to be the way things are. On Celebrity Cruise Lines, if you are vaccinated, you don't have to wear a mask. And if you are unvaccinated, you have to wear a mask in all indoor areas unless you are eating or drinking. And I should just add the note that um, you don't have to wear a mask in your stateroom. That's an indoor area, but that is not included. And finally, on Norwegian, they are the only ones sailing with 100% vaccinated cruises, and so no one has to wear a mask on their cruises. Now, another really interesting thing that I want to have you think about is that on these cruise lines, they're sailing, so this is for cruises sailing out of the United States. For sailings for these cruise lines sailing out of other ports around the world, many of them are requiring guests, all guests, to wear a mask and in the indoor areas on a ship. I haven't been able to nail that down for sure about Norwegian, but I do know that for Celebrity and um, what the protocols are looking like and what I've read for the upcoming season um, in Europe and in other places around the world, it looks like we're going to have masks stay with us for a long time. And so I just kind of wanted to add that to the conversation because if we were thinking that masking is just going to be gone in a month or two and we'll never see it again, I'm not sure of course, but from what I've read it doesn't look like that is going to be the case and so just kind of think keep that in mind um, but I would also keep in mind that things change so quickly and so you never know it might be that by the time the summer spring and summer season rolls around we don't have to wear a mask and so don't just say because I said that 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 is the way it's going to be for sure that is the way it is right now um, so just think about that now I know that a lot of you are just don't mind wearing a mask, it's no big deal. That is um, the category that my husband and I fall into and so we are really glad that we've gone on the couple of cruises that we have been on and that we have another one booked for January. But I also know that there are a lot of people that don't want to wear a mask and I respect that entirely too. And so some of the thoughts that I have had are if you really want to cruise soon and you really don't want to wear a mask, you might want to just take a look at booking a cruise with Norwegian. And I'm not trying to sell one cruise line above another, but that is a way to cruise that you for sure won't have to wear a mask. And so that I think is a, a good thought. And so if you have got a cruise booked with Princess and you're more than 30 days out, but it's in the window that it looks like we're still going to have to wear a mask, you might want to consider canceling that one and picking up a Norwegian one. And then you can always sail with um, Princess a little bit further down the road when those protocols um, regarding having to wear a mask when you don't have to do that anymore. But um, so I just wanted to kind of tell you that. I um, got messages from a uh, lady cruising in um, Greece right now and they all have to wear a mask. And so their, their itinerary was taking in Italy and Greece. And so um, they have to wear a mask there and that is not dictated by the CDC. So it has nothing to do with the CDC. 
you see there, it has to do with the rules are for the countries there. And so I just wanted to add that just as a talking point so that we can all realize that we're not only waiting for something to change with the rules in the United States, but it's just the way things are in different countries as well. So just kind of keep that in mind. And so I hope that you have found this video helpful a little bit. I hope it gives you something to think about and at least um, consider. And so if you have found this video helpful, I hope you will consider subscribing to our channel. We'd love to have you in our Let's Go family. And also, if you have found this video helpful, will you please give it a thumbs up because that really helps us out as well. I will be talking to you all again really soon. You all take really good care. God bless you. Love you. Bye-bye.